Uh, hello there, Mr. Trump. Uh, before we get started here, I'd like to thank you for uh, allowing us to... Oh, really? Are you fucking serious? Jesus. Can someone get the fucking exterminators on that job? Really? Thought we were in a safe spot. I thought we were in a safe spot for this interview. Okay, now there's tails coming out of the wall. Can we- can someone- He you <laughs> just made him faint! <laughs> Mr. Trump! No, no, it's- a, someone get him up, please! Oh god, this is fucking going oh. disastrously already. Oh my- oh, oh god. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh. Are you out of your mind? Uh. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Trump, if you sit down, we can get started here in a minute. Yeah, give me- uh, I, I don't want to uh, turn off my flying powers. Uh, <laughs> I did. Alright, Mr. Mr. Trump, if you can start right. flying- There you go, uh, just okay. like that. Thank, thank you, ready. sir. I'm ready, uh, so, so what What the hell am I doing here, huh? Alright, All right, Mr. So. Trump, so, uh, again, as I was saying earlier before the pony infestation showed itself, um, mm -hmm. we're just gonna do a simple interview to ask you a few questions that we, uh, we ask some folks on Twitter for, and we're gonna get the truth from you, you know, we're gonna- We're gonna get some good hard-hitting answers from you, alright? Oh, oh, all right. Sounds good. Sounds good. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Are you, are you ready, sir? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. So first question is going to come from a Mr. Ryan Green. All How right, much Ryan. money does it take to fill a bathtub? Uh, when it comes to a small loan of a million dollars, uh, you got to make sure that you have a, a very, very big golden bath. There's a, there's a pony right now. Don't, I'm, don't I'm worry. It's dead. It died. It's, it's perfectly fine. It's dead. All right. Good. It's gonna smell after a while. Um. So basically, you know, if you're like me and you have a small loan of a of a billion dollars, uh, you got to make sure you have a, a nice diamond plated, gold bathtub. Uh, and that that'll definitely do the job. A di but, so so you're saying you can fit a small loan of a billion dollars inside of a diamond plated gold bathtub? <laughs> yes, that is exactly okay, what I mean. Okay, perfect. That is the exact answer we were looking for. Now let's move okay. on to the next one real quick. All right. All right. All right, so, Mr. Trump, this next question comes from, uh... Did you, did you just call me Miss Trump? No, 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 Miss Trump, it's fine. Um, no, uh, the, the next question comes from, uh... Oh, look, it's, it's, it's queer trash again. Uh, you... <laughs> that's like your favorite slur. Okay. This one is, Are you actually aware that most of this country would rather burn their eyes with acid than see you as president? Uh, yes. I've, I've met a few people. Uh, they have told me that they would rather jump off a bridge... Uh, and praise Obama or Hitler uh, instead of uh, praising me. Oh, uh, okay, as, pre All as right. president, as president. More controversial views coming from Donald Trump himself. That's fantastic. All right, let's. Uh... All right, so the next question, Mr. Trump, comes from Alyssa. Uh, what does it feel like being stupid? Uh, you fired. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, Alyssa's fired. Oh, okay. Sorry about that, from, Alyssa. From, it turns from out you... Twitter. You're fired from Twitter. Yeah, it you looks like you are fired, that. Alyssa. Uh, yeah, I, I apologize. I do apologize. Uh, but you're the one that asked the question. It is not It is not our fault that you uh, you did that. So, um, <clears throat> Yeah, you're your fired fault. from Twitter. Delete your account. All right, so next question comes from Malord Kai. I'm just going to ignore the fact that's a really strange name. Um, what would you keep in the basement of the White House if you were elected as president? Mexicans. <laughs> oh, God. No, Mr. Trump, no, please don't leave. No, oh, God damn it. Are you, oh, jeez. Next question comes from a Stephen A. Hazelton. Uh, did you really date your daughter? Uh, I can either confirm or deny that I did uh, date my daughter. Uh, <laughs> frankly, it's, not, it's none of your business. It's ridiculous. It's, what, are you, it's, what are you out of your mind? No, 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 sorry, sorry, calm down, it's okay, it's okay, it's fine, yeah, we're fine, we're all, we're all friends here, uh, everything's okay, alright, so let's just move on, shall we? Alright, next question comes from the king, <laughs> uh, are you an egg, Donald Trump? <laughs> Mr. Mr. Trump, it's fine, Mr. 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 Trump, hello? Hello, <laughs> sir, sir, what's so funny, I don't understand, sir? Sir, what's wrong? What's wrong? I, hello, Mr. Trump? Are you there? Are you okay? Do I need to call in an ambulance again? Hello? Are you all right, sir? No, I'm not all right. What's wrong? What, what happened? What happened? What happened? Hello? I think I just saw a ghost. Oh, a ghost of who? Of what? <laughs> of what? What are you talking about? <laughs> this question comes from... Mostly a dinosaur. Are you an egg? Uh, no. <laughs> no, are you sure? Are you sure you're not a bad egg? You 
fired. So, no, 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 you can't fire me. The documentary's not over yet. All right, what, I'll fire sir? you after the documentary. <laughs> sir, sir, could you please, sir, could you sit back down in your chair? You're so, scaring so, people. I'm sorry, I, I still haven't gotten control of my powers yet. I don't, apologize. Don't worry, I'm sure that when you're president, you'll have full control over any and all powers. All right, so the next question comes from B. Dizzle. Why didn't you tell anybody there was a lost child in New York? Because, well, you see, if you were to tell that to people, uh, they would probably think uh, that I caused the child to be lost. Um, when in reality, um, you see, see, I actually don't do a lot of things people think. Um, because, well, I don't know. <laughs> another, another eloquent and intelligent answer from a possible president-elect. I must say, bravo. Thank you. Thank bravo. You. Next question comes from Ken the Cat. What is the name of your hair? Uh, um, uh, Eagle's Nest, because they like to drop their bombs into it. So what you're saying basically is that eagles like to shit in your hair, so you <laughs> called it Eagle's Nest. Yeah, they're, they're not a big fan of me. You remember that time uh, one tried to bite me? Yeah, well, yeah. They, oh, yes, yes, I do recall. They, that they, they've gone another you. level, and now they, they are now dropping their turds into my hair. And God bless that eagle. All right, let's move on. All right, next question comes from Nick Lacey. What do you plan to do to make America great again? Uh. Uh. uh well, you Sir? know what? I. I, I oh. Sir. Hello? Okay. Okay. You're right. You're right in my face, Mr. Just, just, just answer the question, sir. It's okay. Uh, uh, well, you know, we're, we're we're trying our best to uh, make sure that that Obama is definitely oh, oh, is 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 considered one of the worst presidents, and I am the best around. Nothing's ever going to let me down. I'm the best around. Do you have any uh, any other specific things you'd like to say about making America great again? I'm fired. This is ridiculous. Why? Who? Okay. Seriously, why am I doing? I, this is, I I had one day off. One day off. And Sir, I'm don't worry. We're almost done. We're almost done. You can go in a moment. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just uh, just stay right there. I have a dinner date with my daughter. All right. Well, uh, unfortunately, we have come to the last question, Mr. Trump. Uh, before I read, uh, just want to say and thank you for uh, agreeing to meet with us uh, yes. on your day off <sighs> to uh, interview you. Um, yeah. All right. So last question comes from a Trevor Bailey. Uh, it is, would you rather be stuck on a ride with another version of yourself, uh, Gandhi, Alf, or Mr. Krabs? Hmm. Well, you know, it, it's a hard decision between uh, another version of myself or Mr. Krabs because, uh, you know, quite frankly... Me and Mr. Krabs, <clears throat> we have a, a big interest in money. And and why and, why is that? Why do you think? Because obviously you and yourself would both have a very big interest in money. As a matter of fact, the exact same kind of interest in money. <laughs> Sir? Well, you see, me and myself, uh, we would definitely uh, probably try and um, uh, rule the world together. Uh, I'm <clears throat> sorry, I meant, uh, make America great again. Um, right, and, right, of course, of course. Raise a lot of money. Uh, but you see, Mr. Krabs... He'd probably hook me up with a small loan of a million Krabby Patties. Yeah, you know, that is uh, a very excellent point. Very excellent answer, Mr. Trump. I would have uh, Krabby Patties for life. It, for it life, really? A, yes, yes, yes. All right, well, I'm not sure where this interview uh, went exactly, but again, I'd like to thank you for taking time out of your oh-so-busy and important schedule to uh, have an interview with us in a video game. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, yes. Uh, now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go back to hell. <laughs> Am I done being a puppet now? Hey, <laughs> can, 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 we, I think we need a, uh, a fire, a fire. Donald fire Trump stormtrooper confirmed. <laughs> Traitor! <laughs> I can't. Okay, I'm done. Bye. <laughs>